we give a lot of tax relief. But remember, this isn't about I'm cutting your taxes this year or I'm not raising your taxes next year. This is about reform. And we use that word often. And usually we can put any word we want before the word reform and people say, that's great. They don't know what it means, but they like it because it's a positive word. But we put meaning behind that word when we talk about it. We're restoring the sales tax exemption for clothing and shoes under $50. We are eliminating the caps on business tax credits. So businesses can continue to invest in this state. We are eliminating the corporate tax surcharge, as you've heard year after year, and the business entity tax. And why those things are important is because when we talk about people going back to work and being able to have a job and raise their families and pay for their home and put food on their table, they can't do that unless they have a job. And they can't have a job unless businesses can thrive in this state. We are making sure that lost carry forwards can continue, and those are things that the governor has, has taken out. And importantly, in my mind, are phasing out income tax uh, pension. We've talked for many years about pensions being taxed and how that's not fair. People work for years and years and they sit there and then they are supposed to enjoy their golden years and what happens? They're now being taxed on that pension that they worked for. Well, in our budget, we are allowing that to be phased out because we think it's important for you when you put all that hard work and you put all that time and effort into raising your family and working hard that you be able to enjoy the fruits of that. What's important is that these reforms that Senator Fasano and I are talking about today are affecting the middle class of the state of Connecticut. The people that get left out a lot of times. The people that drive this state, the people that most of us are, the people that most of us know. And those are people that need relief and will end up staying in this state. 